first step to installing memory into your motherboard is to find out if it's actually compatible. You can generally do this by looking in the motherboard manual or going onto the motherboard manufacturer's website and they normally give a more detailed list of which particular memory they do support. If it's not supported, sometimes a BIOS update can help support that memory. So once you've found out that your money hasn't been wasted on your memory, you can then proceed to put it into the motherboard. You then have to find out which slot it's going to go into. So on this motherboard, we've got two slots at the back for DDR3 and two at the front for DDR2. We're going to be using DDR2, so we need to open up the latches for them slots. On some motherboards, you will have more than two slots for your particular memory. So make sure that if you've got, for instance, two pink slots and two gray slots, all of DDR2 memory, that you do use them in pairs so that you get the full effectiveness of dual channel. You can then proceed to get your memory modules and put it into the slot. You will notice that on your memory modules there's this little hole here. This is so you can't put the memory in the wrong way because there is a notch in the middle. Offer that up and it goes in place like that. You can then proceed to push the memory modules down into place until they click. 